G'day, my name's Michael Machusik and I'm an independent property analyst. I'm here on Chevron Island on the Gold Coast. Behind me is a new apartment project called Chevron One. Before I tell you more about Chevron One, let me tell you briefly a few things about what's happening on the Gold Coast. There are three numbers that sum up the Gold Coast and these are five, six and seven. Five equals the fifth largest tourist market in Australia with 3.5 million overnight visitors per year. Six equals the sixth largest urban area in Australia with 650,000 permanent residents and this population is increasing by 15,000 people every year. And seven equals the seventh largest economy in Australia worth $36 billion. The Gold Coast isn't a small place anymore. It isn't held to ransom by the White Shoe Brigade anymore, neither. The housing market is less cyclical and acts like a capital city. Also, the Gold Coast is hemmed in. It is the Pacific Ocean to the east, mountains to the west, the New South Wales border and green politics to the south, and the Canelands to the north. I believe it's set to become a more vertical urban area in the future, and quality development sites with uninterrupted views of the ocean and wider surrounds, and in key locations like Chevron Island, will be hard to find. And I believe they will also become much more expensive in the future too. With a permanent population growing at 15,000 people per year, there is a need to build some 5,000 new dwellings every year on the Gold Coast as well. And over the next decade or two, 60% of this demand will come from people either downsizing or retiring. There is a large pent up and growing demand for quality owner resident apartments like Chevron One on the Gold Coast. Today, some 3,000 people call Chevron Island home and there are about 1,900 dwellings on the island as well. The island supports a range of demographic types, including children, and the demographic makeup is as follows. 10% children, 35% young adults, 25% upgraders, and 30% downsizers and retirees. So the island isn't full of old people waiting to die, so to speak. It holds a vibrant, active, and local community. By the way, I'm a frequent visitor to the island. There are several cafes and restaurants that I use when conducting business on the Gold Coast and the island's location is very convenient to many of my clients. The locals already know that living on Chevron Island is special and the statistics provide the proof. Only five out of every hundred existing properties on the island are sold each year and that is far lower than the 12 out of 100 that is the Gold Coast average. Property on Chevron Island is tightly held and it is rare to get an opportunity to buy your stake. Also, local property values are on the rise. The best way to understand what's really going on price-wise in any location is to review what's happening with local land values. In similar locations as Chevron One on the island, land values have risen by 75% over the last five years. These land values now average just over $2,600 per square metre. They were just $1,500 per square metre five years ago. By comparison, land values across the Gold Coast have risen by 30% over the same time period. They average just $700 per square metre across the Gold Coast. There is a big premium being paid to live on Chevron Island. So why do I think Chevron One is worth a closer look? Here are my seven reasons why. One, the team. Benson's Property Group, Mark O.C. Partners Architects and Hutchinson Builders. Two, location great view corridors, and of course being on Chevron Island, within walking distance of the beach and the light rail, which is currently being extended to Burley. Three, apartment designs. These are well thought out, very spacious, with a typical three bedroom apartment being 185 square metres each, with a 2.75 metre ceiling, and with a choice of four levels of quality finish. Four, lift ratio. There is 236 apartments in the tower, over 40 levels, with four lifts. Five, pricing. These are very competitively priced, starting from just $5,000 per square metre. Six, facilities, including pools, 24-hour on-site concierge and management, exclusive resident facilities and extensive gardens. Seven, the look, especially the balconies and the curvaceous spaces. Chevron One on the Gold Coast. I think it's worth a closer look. Thank you.